Science. These little seahorses are just a few months old. They're part of a breeding program in the south of France to restock the Mediterranean Sea with the creatures. The program is being run by the Institute of Marine Science on Ompiers Island. The researchers are feeding the offspring of three male seahorses. When it comes to seahorses, it's the males who carry the eggs. They hold a nuptial parade, they turn towards each other and float to the surface, and the female positions herself like this and places the eggs in the male's pouch. During the next three weeks, 300 youngsters barely one centimetre long are watched closely and fed four times a day with tiny shrimps. The programme aims to build up the population of seahorses as quickly as possible. Preparations for their release start just before their departure for the lagoon. We separate the males and females, release them in different places. We don't want to mix up the brothers and sisters. The Tau Lagoon reportedly holds the most significant seahorse colony in Europe. Two sites have been chosen to release the 200 individuals from the research center. A researcher will follow their release, gathering information about the intriguing little creatures, many species of which are sadly endangered. The fact they've been raised in a closed environment then released boosts their chances of survival. The Meds seahorses face several different threats, pollution and environmental changes in the sea, accidentally being caught in fishing nets and even collection for aquariums.